Hi, Sanakshi. Hi, Ranvi. Welcome Hi. to our Hi. show. Hi. Okay, firstly, your, chem your, your chemistry on screen is looking awesome. I Thanks. must tell you, it's really great. Uh, does it also happen because you guys are so different in real life uh, as people? Probably, but yeah. I think all credit goes to our director, Vikram Aditya yeah. Motwani, who's written two such beautiful characters yeah. for us. And I think just playing them was so much, uh, uh, we got to learn so much, we got right. to uh, be something totally different. Yeah. And uh, I think that's the beauty of it and that's what's turned magically on screen, screen. into something very beautiful. Ranveer. I think that's what makes it an exciting watch, mm -hmm. the chemistry between these yeah. two characters, between these two actors who, you know, um, for all practical purposes, hail from completely different schools of or, and approaches of Correct. acting and to acting. Um, so it makes for a really interesting watch. You're the most spontaneous kind and are you the yeah. most like method actor, Ranveer? Well, I think method is a really abused term. Yeah. I don't think, Overused you know, also. yeah, it's, no, whatever it's, he does work. it's very, very loosely thrown around. Uh, I used to, yes, have a process and prepare a lot. But after having worked with Sanakshi, I think um, I have seen that her her approach is brilliant. Actually, it's because easy. because what it's also easier. Yeah. You also enjoy it yeah. more rather than stress about it, um, and uh, it also leaves room for very very organic and spontaneous things to happen right, you know right. if you prepare and you plan and plot too much uh, at some point it's going to get rehearsed and right. mechanical and what is uh, acting in cinema it's the capturing of uh, of organic moments yeah, uh, so it's she good. leaves so much room for whatever has to happen happens in that moment and that moment that we're talking about is when the camera is rolling like right. she said yeah. so it, it really is a, a brilliant and most it's a naturalist approach <laughs> I think for lack of a better word but um, but yeah I definitely took a leaf out of her book and I've become uh, much more at ease uh, <laughs> with what I do really? now. But isn't there a moment or a particular scene where you're like nervous about it? I know you're spontaneous and you react when the camera rolls but you know have, have I there think ever the, been a moment the like only that? thing that I get nervous about is uh, crying on camera because <laughs> yeah because I can't uh, cry when the there's obviously a unit present oh, over yeah, there. Blah, blah, blah. I can't cry in front of so many people. Oh, it's yeah, really, blah, blah. I don't of know. Of course, it's very taxing. Right? Yeah. It's very yeah. taxing. Yeah. You're, yeah. you're, you're at your most Absolutely. naked, uh, yeah, yeah. you know, emotionally. And uh, <laughs> me personally, I'm, I'm generally a very happy person. So yeah. I like, cannot you know, just <laughs> cry, cry, cry. It doesn't happen. So that is difficult yeah. for me. Yeah. You know, you, you were saying in some interviews about how Vikram Aditya Motwani, your director, actually broke you for this role. It is, it is something that I knew at the very outset when I signed on, yeah. uh, that it was going to be something really different. It's mm -hmm. going to require uh, me to break everything that I know and right. try and explore a different side to myself. I always knew that. But when I actually got down to doing it, I was finding it very difficult mm -hmm. and I wasn't grasping it initially. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. It was actually during workshops when things actually came to a head. And I was like, man, I can't do this. You, you know, I, I just can't. Yeah, we heard on day four you wanted to quit. Yeah. Is that true? I think I one of those Neil Kamal ka plastic chairs. <laughs> I think I picked it up, and patkoed it on the in the workshop huh? in the hall, and uh, and he sat me down and uh, he said something that will resonate with me for the rest yeah. of my life. It kind of was a turning point for me as a performer and as a person. Uh, he said, you know, you you think that you owe it to the world to always make people smile and entertain them and infect them with your energy uh, you don't um, so let go of what has really become a habit for you and try and explore this side of you that I know you have that I can see that you're fearful of showing to people. We are hearing about how you become allergic to the term lucky mascot and <laughs> why. I'm not allergic to it yeah. it's just a uh... It is loosely thrown. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not you be lucky so mascot. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm so lucky lucky mascot. Lucky <laughs> one more time. Really lucky lucky. Just one more time. So. Yeah, I'm not allergic to it. It's yeah. just, um, mm -hmm. I think it's about time people spoke of, um, I mean, they don't, yeah, the work as well. And uh, it's not like they haven't. Mm -hmm. So I think if they only right. spoke about me being lucky and not having time, then I'd be allergic mm -hmm. to it. But it's fine. Thanks so much for being on our show. It was great talking to you. And I hope it's a super success. Thanks, Ranveer. Thanks, Thanks so much. Thank you.